Hello, my name is Cordero. I'm just going to get right into it. This is a tin whistle used in Celtic music. I'm going to play it and then I'm going to play a sample of an instrument that I made based off of this. Obviously, I'm not perfect at that, but fortunately, I don't have to be because I create a simple instrument. And here it is. So as you can see, there are four different things you can control. You have dynamics here, um, going down from just a, a breath. Then it fades in. Uh, you also have vibrato, which uh, CC21. We have reverb here. I'll turn it all the way off so you can hear how it sounds dry. We have some reverb, which you can, well, I just said that. Um, we also have airiness. Um, so you can take the air all the way out. This is the amount of air passing through the instrument. Without the air, it doesn't sound as realistic. You can also crank it all the way up, but then it sounds weird. You also notice that there are a little bit of um, uh, breathing. There's some breathing in there uh, as a part of the release triggers, just to add a little bit of realism. So if I just, uh, I won't turn the actual tone up, I'll just leave the breath in there and you can hear it. Actually, let me mute my microphone so you can hear it more clearly. Alright, um, one other feature you may have noticed is that there are some uh, ornamental tones. Um, so if you hit these notes pretty hard, uh, I have like three different variations of ornaments at the top there. So. Let me turn this air back down. I believe those are all the features. Obviously there's staccato, you have, so yeah, of the keys are just below, you have legato, then you have staccato. Anyway, these are, this uh, instrument will be made available on piano books, so um, do you know, download it and leave a comment. Um, this was more of an experiment to try to see if I can sort of bridge um, sampling and modeling 
and uh, I think it turned out pretty decently, but you know, that's for you to, de to decide. But uh, yeah, so thank you so much for checking this out and uh, hopefully you'll find this instrument useful.